Hello friends, welcome to this video. Today I'm going to talk to you about how you can uh, check the usage and monitor the usage of data in your cell phone. This could be very useful if you are on a restricted data plan or if you're planning to travel with your phone and you will be on a restricted plan and uh, you know you, you, you want to see exactly how much data you are downloading. Uh, there are different apps for this. I'm in the App Store now, so I'm going to search for data and data monitoring and different apps coming the first three that come in is this one by Mobidia Technologies and then this this one for free that is for by Amos and this one is Nutec from Nutec they are all called data monitor so one is green the other one is kind of black and the other one is kind of blue I downloaded the three of them and in this video I want to compare them and tell you in my opinion which one is the best so uh, I already download them and I'm going to open the, the one that I like the less and it will be this one by Carrier okay it I always ask you to if you have your location services on because it has a tab here where it says usage location that it will show you your usage by per location which is kind of cool and the other apps don't have it but besides that I really uh, think or feel that the uh, application its main screen is a little bit uh, I don't know how to say it. It's, uh, it doesn't look very good. It doesn't look very clean. It shows you a bar with the usage of, of Wi-Fi data and cellular data. It also recognizes that my carrier is print and it has some ads like all the free apps. So that's not a big deal. Now, if, uh, you know, with time, these bars will, up, will go up and down. I mean, we, we keep going up. And... Um, depending on the usage. Now, what if you want to reset that? Well, you go to settings and you click on reset data usage and click OK. And you see that here you can also enter your data limit so it will kind of warn you when you reach that. Um, you go back to the main screen and now these bars are down. Uh, and it, start, it reset itself so you can start monitoring an application. Now, this is, this is fine and, I like, and it's not bad, but it's not my favorite. The next app that uh, is for me is ranks uh, number two is this one by Nutec, and it has a more, much more cleaner interface. You know, you have your cellular data and your Wi-Fi data, and big numbers, so it's easy to read. Uh, it also has a projected, okay, a projected amount of data in the two categories, and that is uh, based on the, a month, you know, or, or a billing cycle. And you can set that up in the settings. So if I click on settings, and I go to settings, uh, you can turn on and off background monitoring. You can change the units. Uh, and also, you can click on data settings. And here is where you define your billing cycle so, and uh, the quota and all those things. And also, you can set notifications to warn you when you reach a certain uh, thing. Now, these are actually... Um, very convenient sometimes and uh, you know more advanced than in the other app another thing you could uh, that I like it's it's really just how it looks and uh, of course you also have the ability to reset the data so if you go here reset all defaults and reset data and when you go back they are back in zero. This is good, very useful if you want to monitor a specific application let's say you're you want to know how much data um, uh, Skype uses. So you will turn this on, reset, make a Skype call of a one minute, for example, and then go back to this application and, and it will tell you how much data you used. And this could be very convenient when you need to buy, for example, a SIM card with a specific data plan and with a specific data limit, which is one of my ca the case uh, for me uh, and the reason why I'm downloading these apps. Now, my favorite application, and it's kind of co come close between this one and this one, is this following one. Uh, this application is my favorite for one single reason. First of all, um, it has a timer. So if I go here where it says, let me see it here, on the options, I have a summary, a graph. So if I click on graph, I have graphs. Or if I click here on a map, I have the map usage. Um, of course, my location services are off now. But I also have plans and alarms, and I have a timer, something that I don't have in the other apps. 
So if I want to monitor a specific application, okay, or uh, uh, I want to time my usage, I just click on start and the clock starts and the monitoring starts too. In this case it's monitoring Wi-Fi, but if I click on mobile, it will also add mobile to this clock and I can combine it. I can use only mobile, okay, or I can uh, show only uh, Wi-Fi usage. And when I finish, I, let's say I get out of here and I, I use Skype or whatever and come back and then I click stop and I know exactly how much data or a very good number of how much data I've used. For this reason, this is my favorite app. Now, what uh, you can also do is just have a combination of two apps and just uh, double monitor its usage or the data usage to be extra sure. But anyway, this looks to be really accurate and uh, I highly recommend these apps uh, and thank you for watching.